new right here tonight on The Rant. Senator Mitch McConnell criticizing JCPS school board member Chris Kolb from the Senate floor today for saying that even if all school personnel get vaccines, he'd still be reluctant to open schools right away. Chris Kolb responding by saying teachers are not health care workers. Also on The Rant, comments about the Southern Indiana woman now charged by police with shooting and killing a donkey in Borden, Indiana. But first, you were still talking about the state of unemployment, still waiting and waiting for your money. This is a factory worker out of Louisville, Kentucky. I still haven't got my unemployment check yet. I wish Bashir would uh, step it up a notch or the news should let me know how I should get in contact with somebody to get my unemployment. Since March the 20th, 2020, I haven't received a dime. Yes, I live in Indiana. The lady who shot the donkey, I don't want to see her go to prison, but I think 30 days in jail would suit her fine. Hi, Doug. First, I want to say I support Governor Brashear, but I am a little confused as to where the unemployment situation is concerned. If they can identify the people that are making fraudulent, fraudulent claims, they should be able to identify the people that are not. And now on Mitch McConnell's comments about JCPS board member Chris Kolb, Christine in Louisville, keep in mind, Mitch wouldn't have been reelected without some teachers voting for him. Vivian, I agree with Mitch. These kids play outside with other kids and family. A lot of schools have opened. Make sure they have enough PPE and wear masks. Carol, I'm not a Mitch fan, but I agree with him on this. Schools have been open in other parts of Kentucky, and for the most part, things have been going well. On the impeachment petition aimed at Kentucky Governor Andy Bashir, Charlie in South Louisville sent me this email. I have heard the saying that politics is a blood sport, but now it's about my blood, my life. The supermajority in Frankfurt seems not to care if thousands more die, as long as they can score a political point by removing his emergency powers that are mostly established in the state constitution. Mary in Louisville on our story yesterday. My rant is about the Metro Council wanting to give Metro workers 12 weeks paid leave for having a baby or adopting. They should save up their vacation and sick leave like everybody else who doesn't work for Metro government. Why should taxpayers pay for them to have babies? Denise and Bullitt County on our night team report with the Clark County Health Director exposing the lying and other ways people are trying to get COVID shots. This is truly abominable and should be punished. Find them $100 to $500 per offense, post their names on a public forum, move them to the bottom of the vaccine list. What is wrong with people? Well, send me your rants about the flap between Senator Mitch McConnell and the local school board member Chris Kolb. Here's how you can rant tonight. Post a message on my Facebook page. You're welcome to use Twitter at WHAS11Doug. Keep your emails coming to the rant at WHAS11.com. And the toll-free rant line is open at 855-749-1101.